Hello and welcome to the series of Cisco Email Security Updates. Today, I'm sharing the instructions on how to configure Search and Remediate on Axing OS version 13.5.1. Malicious attackers are always trying to steal your employees' credentials or corporate secrets by sending benign URLs via emails that are later redirected to phishing content. In some occasions, the administrator might realize too late that someone has been compromised in the company. Cisco Email Security therefore provides a search and remediate features that enable the administrator to retrieve the suspicious email directly from employee mailbox. Let's take a look at the search and remediate settings. I have logged into a on-prem exchange server. First thing we need to do is to create a service account that has the impersonation privilege to access the exchange mailboxes. We are going into Exchange Management Shell and enter the command to give the impersonation role to the service account that we have just created. As you can see, the assignment is successful. We are accessed into Cisco Email Security Appliance. Under the System Administration tab, we will find the account setting. We want to create an account profile. We will name the profile as Exchange in this case. We are going to select the profile type to be Exchange On-Prem. We are entering the username and password to the service account for which we have assigned the impersonation role privilege. We are going to specify the host name of the Exchange server. We need to click Submit and commit the change before we are able to test the connection. Now we are ready to test the profile. We will now be able to test the connection. In this case, we already have created an email account. Enter the email address and click Test Connection. The connection status show a successful connection with the ability to read and write the mailbox. We will map the profile with the company's email domain. In this case, we enter the email domain and select the profile that we have just tested. Click the Submit and commit the changes again. Let's have a look at how search and remediate work in action. We have an internet user sending a malicious email to your employee. The email is now landing at the employee's mailbox. As the administrator, let us log into Cisco Email Security Next Gen User Interface and access to the tracking service. The malicious email is now available in the tracking search results. We are able to select the particular email and click Remediate button. We will name the remediation batch name as Remediate1 and choose the action as Delete Email. Click Apply to take the selected action right away. We return to the Outlook client and make sure the malicious email is removed from the employee mailbox. Let's find out the reporting page for Search and Remediate. Reporting templates is available for Search and Remediate feature. We are going to select Monitoring tab and choose Remediation Report. As we are now able to find the remediated activities listed in the summary page of the Remediation Report. We are allowed to deep dive into remediation batch by clicking the sub-reporting tab. Bars in different colors represent the type of remediation action initiated by the administrator. The batch that we have launched is now displayed as completed status. I hope you enjoyed the short video and thank you for watching.